Hello everyone, maybe you're running into an issue on Snapchat where for some reason it keeps telling you that login is temporarily disabled, possibly due to some virus or some malware or some whatever other thing that you know you could possibly be getting on Snapchat. Now there's a few ways to fix this, but most of the time this is a widespread issue, meaning that Snapchat will randomly have a random issues all over the place and you will pretty much have to kind of wait it out for them to go and fix it. So a great way to go ahead and test if this is a Snapchat problem or your device problem is to go ahead and make your way over to a website like downdetector.com, maybe some other website like that. Go ahead and scroll through and if Snapchat is on there, then probably it's probably down. You can also make your way over to the comment section of this video or even like Twitter and see if Snapchat is trending. If Snapchat is trending, then probably it's a Snapchat issue and it's not really a problem with you or specific Snapchat account. Now let's say nobody else is talking about it and it seems like it is your specific account. Well then what you may have to do is go ahead and see if there's an update available for Snapchat. So make your way over to your App Store or your Google Play Store and all you want to do here is go ahead and update your Snapchat version. So just go ahead and update the Snapchat application and for a majority of people out there that'll probably end up fixing the situation and I'm probably going to guarantee you that'll probably end up fixing it for you. If that still doesn't fix it, I'd recommend deleting the Snapchat application and just re-logging and re-downloading it in. So go ahead and remove app, go ahead and delete this application from your device, go ahead and reinstall it. And again, this can probably end up fixing the situation too. Again, maybe it's not a guarantee, but it is another thing you can do as well. On top of that, you wanna make sure you have a proper Wi-Fi connection or data connection you know, embedded in your phone as well. If you don't, then that can possibly, you know, have, that could possibly be the issue as well. So there's a few different ways to do it. Most probably it's a Snapchat server problem and you're pretty much gonna to have to wait until they fix it but that should end up fixing it for you. If you have any other thoughts or questions, please let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button, that would be so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out till then.